Hi, Martin here. Today I'm out here at the uh, Henderson, Nevada Pick Apart. And, you know, I come out here quite often. If you've seen any of my videos, I'm out here all the time. Well, I just happened to be cruising the GM section. This is like their uh, mid size cars. You know, you got your Oldsmobiles, Pontiacs, Chevrolets, and uh, Buicks. Well, I got myself right here. We got a Pontiac Grand Prix. This is an 04. And the reason I'm cruising this uh, GM area is because of that 3.8 supercharger. Well, I like walking through here and they just recently got some new inventory. I think it was about a week ago. And I, I have walked through here. And when I did that, I found three of them out here. Here's one of them right here. And uh, these are real popular in like your Jeep 4.0 engines. You know, people wanting to supercharge their engine. Well, because you can buy kits where you can get this supercharger already, or perhaps you can get the kit without the supercharger and you just get everything else, you know, minus supercharger. Now I'm gonna show you how to pull one of these off of here and for how little you can actually get one of these. All right? Let's get started. Now I was out here, like I said, a week ago, and I walked the uh, rows here looking for if they had any more. See, here's another one right here. Boom, I just had to go down one car. <laughs> and uh, this looks like another Pontiac. Yeah, look at that. It even says GTP supercharged. And this particular one is out of a 98 Pontiac Grand Prix. Being a 98, it may have a lot of miles on it. I, I usually look for like oil change stickers or something like that to give some kind of indication. Uh, looks like someone actually started taking a few things off of here. Look, they got the plug wires removed. And they pulled the uh, fuel injector fuel rail up like this to get it out of the, get that out of the way so they were probably after that so there's another one right there oh and look here we didn't have to go very far there's number three right here let's see what we got here and this is out of a 06 Pontiac Grand Prix Oh yeah, I remember seeing this one. That's not a real good sign. I mean, it looks like there's a hole in the uh, intake tube. And who knows what, how much dirt that sucked. So that's another thing we're going to check is the condition of uh, this after we pull it out of here. You got to just love how clean these pickup parts are. All the aisleways all nice and clean. And you got concrete to work on. Okay. Hmm. Comp G. Competition group. Now one of the first things you want to do is go ahead and remove the belt. Most people just cut them. Like this one had already been cut by somebody. Um, and you can check the coupler. If you move this back and forth vigorously, if it doesn't make any noise, that's a good sign there. Otherwise, you might hear a little clunk, clunk right back in here. And that is just a bad coupler. Now, those are rather inexpensive to replace. So it's not a real big deal. All right, we got 10 millimeter hardware. See if we can get some of these spot plug wires out of the way. Oh, 
You want to disconnect all of your uh, fuel injectors. Never gotten one of these quarter inch drive impacts. Let me tell you, they are a big time saver and they are rather powerful. Well, you can't get the impact in every place. There's some uh, 13 millimeter hardware you gotta remove as well. Okay. There's another 13 millimeter right back here. There we go. Got the injectors loose here. That was easy. I mean, it might have taken me 15 minutes in real time to uh, pull that out of there. That's what it looks like the intake looks like. So yes, it is a specialty intake for the 3.8, you know, to put a supercharger on it. Now flipping the uh, supercharger over, here you can see the, the veins right here. I mean, there's a little bit of scratchiness right there. It's not bad at all, though. It's, I'd say this one's in pretty decent shape. And uh, I think I'm going to have to buy this one here and just uh, hang on to it or resell it. All right, there you have it. That uh, didn't take long at all. And um, go up to the front counter. We'll see... Uh, what the damage is going to be now a lot of times in some uh, salvage yards they're going to charge you extra for some of this these sensors you may want to take those off if you don't need them um, and maybe uh, there is some way of uh, I'm sure there is putting a supercharger on your 3.8 GM and uh, I mean you just have to get the intake I'd get the injectors because they are definitely going to be more cc per minute uh, injectors and i imagine there's something to do with the computer as well on those but uh, that'd be an if i had a gm 3.8 i'd be putting one of these bad boys on there you know 60 percent jump in power is always nice isn't it but these are very popular for your 4.0 jeeps so if you want to save yourself some money this is one way to go 
and they seem to be readily available. I mean, we've got three of them out here right now. I've purchased two or three in the past years. I mean, it's been quite a while, but, and, and resold them. So, well, if you found this video helpful and informative, I sure appreciate the thumbs up. And if you've never subscribed to me before, please hit that subscribe button right down there and that little bell symbol right next to it. And that way you get notified the next time I upload a video. I'm also an Amazon affiliate. Please check out the links down in the description where I products and tools I may have used in this video. And you can do all your Amazon shopping through one of those links and the channel earns a small commission. I sure appreciate that. Thanks again for watching and we will see you on the next one. All right, I made it home. And as you can see, I got two superchargers. Uh, this one here being off the uh, 98, and then this one here being off the 04. And the total damage for both of them total out the door was 144.47. Here's the... So that comes out to 72.24 for one supercharger. And what you're being charged is $55 a supercharger, $10 core, then you got your sales tax, and out here we're at 8.375%. And there's also an environmental charge of $3.30. That's for two. So, and then some other charge for 28 cents. Whatever that is. Hmm. Okay. Um, yeah, I just decided to go ahead and get both of them. And there's the one left out there. Now, these are different generations. Uh, I'm pretty sure the one off the 98, I believe, is a Generation 3. I could be mistaken. And the one off the 04 is a Generation 4. And they went up to Generation 5s, as far as I know. Now, uh, they change throttle bodies. This one having a 3-bolt, this one 4-bolt, and this being at 72 millimeter, this one at 77 or 76, 76 millimeter. So a little bit larger on the later model uh, supercharger. Well, like I was saying before, I hope you enjoyed this, found it helpful and informative. And if you've never subscribed to me before, please hit that subscribe button right down there in that bell symbol. And that way you're notified the next time I upload a video. Also check out my Amazon links below where the uh, channel earns just a tiny little bit of a commission, but it sure helps. I want to thank you again for watching, and we will see you on the next one.